Welcome everybody, I'm Alexander Lintz, Head of Content of WatchAdvisor.com and with me today Christian Selmoni. Hello Alexander. He is Head of Style and St Heritage. Style and Heritage at Vachon Constantin. And today we're going to talk about the new models presented by Vachon Constantin at the SIHH 2019. They are just in front of us, a selection of novelties. Christian, um, if I talk to someone like you uh, with some 28, 29 years, I think you are with Vachon Constantin. Yes, time. already. Time is passing um, really quick. Uh, I think uh, you're the right and the appropriate person to answer me some tricky questions because I am a little bit surprised because you know, guys, that I like blue. I even wear blue glasses. I was, by coincidence, totally blue today in the sense of I wear, I'm wearing blue gloves. Uh, gloves. Uh, and I see only blue watches in front of yes. me, different styles of blue watches. Um, did you inhale blue, everybody, or was it? <laughs> how come that we have blue, blue, and blue here? I think I think it's a, it's a very very interesting question. So I think first of all we have seen in the in the recent year uh, a lot of recent years a lot of interest for for the blue color, which was uh, I would say firstly um, mostly related to uh, sports watches and tool watches. And uh, now, uh, little by little, we see that uh, the blue color on the for, for dials is uh, is moving also to to more classic, elegant designs. And this is uh, why also we have decided to to introduce this uh, this uh, very uh, interesting uh, new uh, models, which uh, feature all uh, blue dial. I'd like to say that uh, we have developed a different uh, kind of blue. So I think it's a very important point. So in other words. Every collection of Vacheron Constantin that we have here has its own blue. So maybe we'll talk about it. Yeah, we will, of course, of course. Okay. Very interesting. Yeah, yeah. We have um, additions to the collections of the 56. Yes, indeed, that yes. you started last year. Yes. And last year it was uh, launched with a silver and a, and a black dial. So Both. we are, we are, <clears throat> we we have in fact silver dial and we have some gray dials as well. Gray dials, so they yeah. are gray. Gray and silver. Exactly. So. And, um, there are two editions uh, in blue. There is one edition uh, in the overseas collection, and we have three editions in the patrimony yes, collection. Absolutely. Let me right away start because it's a collection I very much like myself. Uh, the fifty-six. It's a young, dynamic uh, watch. Uh, probably one would have not expected to see from Vachon Constantin when I saw it last year. I said, "Wow, cool." That's a good way to attract a new, younger clientele. Thank you. And uh, if I take, uh, let's say, the, the uh, calendrier complet or the uh, complete calendar, as they call it, yep. it's the right way? It's right, right. The, what, tell me about this blue. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> this particular blue. So I think, like, like, like you are exactly mentioning, Alexander, so the, 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 the idea behind uh, 56 is also to have, a, I would say, a, a, a watch that, that that will be less maybe formal than patrimony, for example. And for this reason, we have decided to work a very special uh, blue color. So we, we call it a petroleum blue. Petroleum so, blue. So this is, okay. a, this is a blue color which, which has some gray tone inside. And I think the result is really uh, fantastic. It's giving a lot of uh, sophistication to, to the watch face. And I think it's, uh, it will be a great addition to the line. And uh, I feel really uh, very confident, personally speaking, mm -hmm. about the presentation of this uh, of this uh, new uh, blue dial versions of uh, 56. I think many of you who know me meanwhile uh, would say, okay, no wonder that he likes the watches. But honestly speaking, I would immediately take uh, the calendrier complet or the... Uh, complete calendar. Complete That's calendar, yes, yeah. complete calendar. I put it on a wrist here yeah, and... <laughs> I love it, I have to say. Very nice. I prefer blue to the light gray and the, and the silver dial you had last year. Honestly speaking, you have to have a closer look to that decision or to that new blue on, the, on this uh, 56 collection. Now if I swap over to the overseas, that's a much more intense yes. blue. So, uh, really like, much more intense. Sorry, yeah. Yeah, no. Uh, In, but, indeed, yeah. So the, the, the reason is that uh, we have a very special blue for, for overseas dials. So this blue is, uh, is uh, part of the signature of the overseas uh, line. So we have exactly the same blue that we have on other models of the line. But uh, the difference here is that we are, we are combining this uh, very intense 
a blue color together with rose gold to create something which is very dynamic. So that's, that's the, this perpetual calendar with the blue dial on the rose gold is a very interesting addition to the line as well. Yeah, it's a very, it's a very thin, by the way, very thin uh, perpetual calendar, uh, automatic perpetual calendar, automatic movement, uh, indicating uh, the entire, entire, uh, all what the perpetual calendar should indicate, including a moon phase. Yes. And I think uh, this is a watch worn uh, uh, with jeans or with a shirt. It looks simply gorgeous. As eh? you want, yeah. yeah. Sure, I, 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 I have to say, I agree with yeah, you. I have to say, with the rubber strap. It would be really nice. Yeah, with the rubber strap, it even takes away some of the, the heaviness of the gold okay. and makes it really... Right. Uh, ah. I think so, yeah. Very I think it's, it's a very... For me, it's a very interesting combination of uh, a sporty character, but a very elegant too, uh, thanks to the thick to the thinness of yeah. the of the yeah. movement, and it's uh, it's, it's really a, a relaxed, a cool uh, way to to wear the overseas in, a, but still uh, elegant as well. Yeah. So. Moving uh, towards the the uh, patrimony, we are in the ultra thin now, and uh, it's again a different blue. <laughs> it is obviously <laughs> we stress the word blue sorry guys so yes uh, as we as we as we know our, what is important for us is patrimony is really uh, one if not the the iconic collection of Vachon Constantin and uh, patrimony is, is all about uh, sophistication so that's why we have worked another another kind of blue and this blue is uh, the name of this blue is majestic blue and this blue color is, uh, is combined together with a sun ray uh, background, which, uh, which gives a lot of, uh, of life to, to yeah, the watch face of the patrimony. If, so if again... I, if I turn the watch with the light, you really see, uh, uh, the, you see really the, the, the light reflecting and you see this sun ray type absolutely. of dial. Yeah. So <clears throat> we, are, we are offering this new uh, majestic blue color uh, only in combination with rose gold, also again to create a very sophisticated, interesting um, kind of new so combination between rose and rose and blue. And I think the result is also uh, extremely interesting. I don't know what you think about. Honestly speaking, as a dress watch, I immediately also would put it on my wrist. The watches are thin, elegant. Yes. So if you are dressed uh, in a in a proper way to wear such a watch, would be really the perfect fit. Uh, distinguish you probably mm. as a gentleman sure, sure. <laughs> because it is an attitude to wear such a watch and it's maybe also a statement absolutely so, uh, it's maybe a little bit more difficult than to then to wear a, another brand that you don't have to explain with a Vachon Constantin you might be asked a question but then you have a lot of stories to tell yeah, it's a uh, an old, the oldest ever, um, yeah. the, the still oldest manufacturer we founded Absolutely. in 1755 and so on. There's tradition and so on. So uh, I think a very good uh, decision to do that. And finally, for those who like it a little, little bit more complicated, we have a indication, retrograde, uh, how you say that in English? Uh, Retrograding day re date. Yeah, retrograding day date indication. Uh, on, a, on a very nice but still let's say a, a comfortably wearable yes. thin elegant watch with an automatic movement mm -hmm. so you have a three choices and uh, oh it would be difficult for me which one is your favorite by the way well it's a it's a, it's a <laughs> difficult question I have to, I have to say that uh, uh, very frankly I, I really adore this is very special blue of the 56. I think this combination of blue and gray is yeah. just stunning. And it gives to, to the 56, uh, I would say, uh, a great uh, dynamism and a great yeah. elegance too. So I think it really matches perfectly with the line. Yeah. I, I mean, I like the others too. But uh, if you really ask me the question directly like that, I, I, I would answer uh, 56. Because this blue is so special. Ah, I have to agree. <laughs> I have to agree. I told you in the beginning. It was before I asked him. I would go for. A, I would really also go for this petrol blue. It's it's so perfectly the blue you want to see today or you want to have on your wrist, worn with a jean, worn with a shirt, with a with a, let's say a, a, and gr and gray color as well. Yeah, you can have a gray suit and wear it. Yeah, of course you could. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Very nice, even. Thank you so much. Um, yes, Christian. I went through those. Uh, 
new uh, new watches. Uh, thank you for presenting me them and having me. Our and, pleasure, I think. Okay, uh, thanks a lot. Thank you guys uh, for watching. Um, many of you now will say, okay, we didn't expect anything else than Alexander presenting another blue watches, but you know already, I like them, I can't, oh, I can't. Um. But you have, you have to carry on with liking the blue color. No, I, I do. It's a good job. I was one of the promoters of blue for many that. years, many years. I always yeah. said, come on guys, stop black. I've seen so many black dyes. Yeah gray dyes, white dyes, why don't blue? We all wear jeans, we all go in, in let's say, a more relaxed way and we, we need watches that fit on our wrists. And I think it's nice to see this blue color which is now moving into more, let's say, elegant classic yes, dress watches. Yeah. So I yeah, think it's yeah. a great match. Yeah, you go really balancing a little mm -hmm. bit and you are not... I think so. And it's not one soup, it's really, you have to see the difference oh, in that great. Every, every time piece, uh, every collection has, has its own personality. Absolutely. So I think it's also what you expect from, from a maison from like Vachon Constantin. Christian Salmoni, the last word. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you, Alexander. Thank Pleasure. you guys for watching. Uh, you. If you like what we are doing, please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our videos, and uh, uh, do use the comment section just underneath here. Write your comments. I will, as quick as possible, answer to all of your questions. And thank you once again for watching. And Take it as granted that blue is a color that will stay in the industry and not disappear so quickly. Bye-bye. Great. Thanks. Thank you, Christian.